why? You were on track to close this week and then said, actually, I, I'm not going to do this. I did this crazy thing called changing my mind. It was, <laughs> uh, it's wild, I know, but, uh, but I did it. I, you know, I left uh, uh, yeah, hundreds of millions of dollars behind, but I did it because I feel like um, there are a lot of venture funds right now in the Valley. Every couple days I see new announcements of new funds, and I felt like after 10 years in the business uh, or close to it, uh, there might be other ways to have a bigger impact on some of the problems that I think are worth tackling. Now, I know initially it was a three to five hundred million dollar fund, then there was a report it was two hundred thirty million dollars. Did you have any trouble raising the funds that you wanted? Or this is no, this was is, this really, you know, this your is a, uh, yes, uh, th this is a time where there is tremendous capital available, especially if you have a track record. Uh, and um, that doesn't mean that it's the right thing to do. Hmm. Uh, so there's a, interest rates are low, people are looking for, uh, institutions are looking for places to deploy money. Venture is one of those places, um, but it's almost overfunded. So it's almost peak VC, I would say. Now you also were planning to do this on your own. Yes. And I'm curious why, and you know, if there are so many other funds out there, why couldn't you do it differently? Yeah, I, you know, I did that once, uh, starting <laughs> at uh, a place called Google Ventures. And uh, I think, I've, virtually everything I've done uh, in my life, apart from uh, having a child, I've done alone or started it alone. And then I was fortunate to build an amazing team at Google Ventures. And I feel like they're doing an outstanding job. There's lots of great funds in the Valley, but there are real problems as well. There are funds out there that I can help. Um, but I don't know that being a professional VC, that the world needs yet another venture fund right now.